understanding, scalping a ticket, a deep dive into slang. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore a very interesting phrase in English, scalping a ticket. This phrase is commonly used in everyday conversations, especially when talking about events and tickets. Let's dive into what it means and how you can use it in your own conversations. The phrase, scalping a ticket, refers to the act of buying tickets for an event, like a concert or a sports game, and then selling them at a higher price for profit. This is often done by individuals who are not officially authorized to sell tickets. It's important to note that scalping is illegal in many places, and the legality can vary depending on the region and the specific circumstances. The term, scalping, has its roots in American history, but its use in the context of ticket sales is quite different. Originally, scalping referred to the practice of removing the scalp of an enemy, but over time, the term evolved. In the context of tickets, it symbolizes taking something at a lower value and selling it for a higher price. 1. I wanted to go to the concert, but it was sold out, so I had to buy a scalped ticket for twice the price. 2. Be careful when buying tickets outside the venue. There are many people looking to scalp tickets. 3. Scalping tickets is frowned upon because it often denies genuine fans the chance to buy tickets at the original price. In this section, we'll discuss how ticket scalping is viewed in different cultures and the legal implications. While some see it as a way to make quick money, others view it as unethical and harmful to the event industry. Understanding the legal and cultural context of ticket scalping is crucial, especially for travelers and international students. Thank you for watching. We hope this video helped you understand the meaning and usage of scalping a ticket. Remember, language is not just about words, but also about the culture and context in which they are used. Stay tuned for more interesting lessons on English phrases and idioms. Happy learning!